call it a field of dreams in southwestern Ontario. By 2027, this massive space will be transformed into a Volkswagen plant, making batteries for electric vehicles. It's a mega project worth billions, and this small city has hit the jackpot. Well, St. Thomas is pretty proud right now being able to have that future in place. Consider it a comeback story for St. Thomas. Its once thriving auto sector lost thousands of jobs more than a decade ago when the Sterling truck facility was shut down, then the Ford assembly plant closed as well. We're here today celebrating this, but this is be something that our grandchildren see the spin-offs of. Carbon neutral. Now, like so many automakers, German giant Volkswagen is promoting an electric future, with EVs set to make up half of new car sales worldwide by 2035. So Canada is going big on the business of batteries. The landscape is competitive, but we're still uh, we're still definitely in the game. The governments of Canada and Ontario aren't saying how much money they're pledging, but industry officials hope the VW plant creates 2,500 new positions and thousands more spin-off jobs. We're celebrating the largest single investment in the auto sector in the history of Canada. The makers of GM, Ford and Chrysler vehicles already announced future plans for Canadian facilities to produce EV batteries. The country is banking on its reserves of raw materials, promising to help supply VW with lithium, nickel and cobalt. It's tens of thousands of pounds of rocks that go into uh, these batteries. Another factor that drew this auto giant to Ontario is the province's supply of clean power. So VW can promote its future electric vehicles not only as greener when they're on the road, but even as they're built. Thomas Dagg, CBC News, Toronto.